right? If you have a table of data in your spreadsheet like this and you want it to be sorted, so we'll say this is sorted by column A, you can do that pretty easily by going up to data and choosing one of the sort options. But then when you come back later and you add a new entry, say you add it at the bottom, you have to redo the sort every time. But if you use this add-on called stay sorted, which I'll show you in one second, new rows will automatically be sorted. So we've already installed this add-on, but if you haven't yet, if you come over to the right of your screen and just make sure you're showing the side panel here, if you don't see yours, you may have to click on this arrow to get it to pop out and hit the plus button. And from here, just search for stay sorted. Uh, but I have it already installed, so I'll start it up. And it gives you a sidebar. There's just a few options to get this started. And the first thing that you need to do is tell stay sorted where your data is. So we'll say it starts in column A and it goes all the way over to C. And we'll just click here for that range that we highlighted to become the activated range. Our data does have a header, so we'll just leave this checked. And since we're sorting by the item description and that's in column A, We'll leave it as sort by column A, but you can change that here. This will pick any column that's in your range. We'll do it in ascending order. And for this last field, we're going to check when the rightmost column is updated. And that means when we enter a value in the rightmost cell of the table, that's when the sort will kick in. So that's the option we'll use. And we need to save this sort. And now we're all set. So we'll come back over to the left and we'll say we're going to add some light bulbs at the bottom. And we'll say 20, 23 of them. And since we picked for this to sort when the rightmost column is updated, I'm not going to type this in just yet, but I'll tell you my expectation is that this will get sorted up into the other light bulbs. So if we did not have this add on running, you'd have to manually resort it. So we'll put in the price. We'll say we got these a little bit cheaper. They're, they're 847. Hit enter, give it one second and it sorts for you automatically. All right. So let's look at another example. This will be on sheet two. And you'll see when you look at this, not every row is completely filled out. So we want a slightly different setting for this. But the first thing that you want to do is select the range. And we'll update it here. We still have a header, but the sort by column that's moved to column B. So we have a date field now added to the left in column A. So we want B. We'll leave it in ascending. But here's what we're going to do different. When we choose to sort timing, we're going to say only update this once the sort column is updated. We'll save this. But let's go over to the left and talk about what this means. So when you choose just when your sort column is updated, one reason why you might do that is if you're not always working left to right. So let's say you know what the date is today. Let's say it's 4, 18, 23. We're going to leave the sort field blank for now because that'll initiate the sort. And if it's a large table, you might kind of lose it because it'll go up to where it belongs. Uh, so we'll leave that blank for now. We'll say 48, the weight is seven. We'll say it costs $1.23. Selling price, uh, $2. Well, let's say we don't know the vendor on this, so, but now that we have everything filled out that we can fill out, we'll come back in. Well, we'll say it's a light bulb again. Light bulb, hit enter. And now once that column's updated, it'll take just a second and it'll sort. If you want to learn more about this plugin, I put a link on the screen right now. There's a free trial for the add-on if you install it, see if it works for you. Thanks for watching.